We're going to look at plugins. Just what is a plugin? A plugin is an aftermarket module that adds functionality to your software. Plugins for PaintShop Pro are created by Corel and external third parties, including the PaintShop Pro developer community. PaintShop Pro has an advanced plugin interface to give you access to a myriad of third party image editing tools that interface seamlessly. In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to install and configure a plugin. One popular example of the plugins are the Google Nick collection, which offers a powerful collection of tools for custom filters, retouching, sharpening, and much more. I'll install the Google Nick collection, but the process is the same for most all plugins. Now, as I already have it downloaded, I'm going to go to my download folder and I'll double click on the installer. Note the location that it's going to be installing to. Now during the install process, you may be asked to select a host application. If none is listed, don't worry about it. I'll just click install and we can configure it later. After the install process, I'll click finish. Now it's time to configure PaintShop Pro. From the File menu, I'll go down to Preferences and then down to File Locations. In here, I want to scroll down. I'm going to select Plugins. I'll click on Add and then I'm going to browse to where the plugin was installed. Once I have it selected, I'll click OK. I want to make sure that I have under folder options, enable and use subfolders, and I'll select OK. With an image opened in PaintShop Pro, you can now access your newly installed plugins by going to the effects menu, down to plugins, and then I can select the plugin set that I want to use. Let's go ahead and play with a couple of them. I'll select analog, And I'm going to maximize this to full screen. And here you can see I have some different settings in here that I can select. This particular one is camera views. You'll note that there's a drop down. Now this tutorial is not to go through the various plugins within the Nick collection, but I just wanted to show you a couple of different ones that are kind of interesting. I'm going to select wet plate. I'll click OK on this one and I'll just go do one more plugin. I'll go on to this image from my effects menu down to plugins, to Nick collection, and I'm going to use color effects. I can select color filters. Left clicking on this icon gives me some samples of different filters that I can use on this image, depending on the type of effect that I want. I'm going to click my back button and let's select glamour glow. I kind of like this one, adds a bit of a strong glow to it. I'll click OK. 
Now you can use this method to install most third-party plugins, as long as the plugins are compatible with PaintShop Pro. For example, PaintShop Pro currently supports four of the eight Photoshop plugin interfaces. They are Filter Module 8BF for the more common of Photoshop plugin modules. They allow editing of pixel data like special image effects. Export Module 8BE, Format Module 8BI, Import Module 8BA. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial on installing and using plugins in Corel PaintShop Pro. If you found this tutorial on YouTube while searching for training content, please be sure to head on over to the Discovery Center at learn.corel.com for more equally informative videos.